Poor dog. Hold on. I shouldn't have done that. That was ridiculous. I know I love you. Anyway, okay. So, I wasn't planning on doing this, and I haven't posted in a long time, and I don't really know why I'm doing it now. Well, I do, but anyway. Um, the last video I think I posted was all like, oh, I was bulking, and I'm starting to cut, and oh god, the breakouts are legit right now. Um, the dog's in my lap, which is why I'm like, I'm not like weird. Anyway, um, uh, it was all like, I was bulking, now I'm cutting, and, um, I'm still cutting. I did the whole, okay, <sighs> what spurred this on was the fact that, like, my body is destroyed right now. It's completely, like, um, um, it's just, like, beaten down. I'm supposed to be cutting, but I'm, like, not losing weight at all. Um, I just, like, okay, so January, I started doing the whole, like, paleo thing again, which I absolutely hate paleo. I think paleo is stupid. I don't believe in a diet where, like, you should cut out everything, um, or, like, certain food groups or anything like that, but I was like, you know, everybody swears by it, everybody does it, I'm gonna try something different, even though macro counting worked for me last year, I'm gonna do it this way anyway. So I spent, like, two, one and a half, almost two months of doing that and like nothing changed everything was stupid and uh, I was mean and I was nasty and I was tired all the time and I had zero energy which is terrible because I was in a competition and I was you know I'm I'm, I'm trying to lose fat but gain muscle for CrossFit and I my training got up, so instead of just doing, like, regular CrossFit, I'm also doing, like, Misfit programming, which is also CrossFit, but it's a little more intense. Um, I'm doing that, like, three to four days a week, and uh, Paleo just wasn't cutting it, so I started to count my macros again. Oh, I'm sorry, am I boring you? Is that what it is? Somebody wants to go on a walk, which we're doing right after this. But anyway, so... I started counting my macros again, and, uh, like, this week in general has just been, like, some of the highest highs of my life and the, like, lowest lows of my life in terms of not, 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 just in terms of, like, lifting and working out and stuff like that. I, um, like, I sucked at everything I did. I couldn't hit my old numbers in, like, cleans and squats and... I just, like, couldn't lift anything. I couldn't move weight. I couldn't squat 170 pounds. I can only squat, like, 140. And I was like, we're in the middle of the open right now, which is, like, five to six weeks long. Like, what's wrong with my body? Why isn't it doing what I want? Um, I started taking creatine again, um, which is good for lean muscle growth, but it also bloats you, and, like, it also breaks your face out, which, like... Truth. Truth time, you know, breaking out like nobody's business. Um, so that was like at the beginning of the week. And then at the middle of the week, if you follow my Snapchat, you know I was like, finally, I'm starting to lean out a tiny bit. And, um, which is great, which is what you want, finally. Um, but then this morning, I went to weigh myself to like adjust my macros again, because if you, okay, if you're not familiar with macros it's carbs fats protein grams for how much you weigh and you adjust them if you want to excuse me sir no you adjust them you know if you want to maintain your weight lose your weight lose weight gain weight whatever <clears throat> so i was going to adjust it because if i lost weight you know you got to adjust your macros to reflect that to keep losing weight um i go and i weigh myself and i weigh like <sighs> seven pounds more, which granted, that's why I hate weighing myself, because the scale 
Fs with your brain so much, it's ridiculous. Because, like, yesterday, I performed 16.2, the open workout, which was... I feel, like, so stupid describing this because a lot of people probably don't care. But the 16.2 was um, 25 toes to bar. You're hanging toes to bar. 50 double unders. And then, like, 15 heavy-ish squats. And then you repeat it again, but the squats get clean. Squats get heavier. You repeat it again. The next round, the squats get heavier. Um, and I made it to round four, and I got three one rep max PRs at, I, I cleaned at 115 and squatted them. I got three of those, which I've never lifted in a clean before in my life. So I was like riding this wave of like awesomeness and I was so happy. Um, but then like I weighed myself today and I was like, well, this sucks. And here's the thing I'm getting at, like lifting and every, <laughs> oh, well, yes. I know I love you so much. We're going to go on a walk soon. <gasps> I said it. The look. The look. Walk. Um, especially this time of year for me is like, it's so much dedication. And I think not even half the battle. I think 80% of the battle is all mental, mental, is a mental game because Things happen that suck. Things happen that are great. And you kind of just got to find that balance of like, why are you doing it? What's your end goal? Are you happy? Like, you might be exhausted. Do you have a good group of support around you? Um, and luckily, I think generally I do. People kind of, for the most part, understand. And they're not just like, you know. Take sacrifice. You know, I've given up a lot of things to try and to try and get better, you know? And um, luckily I have good friends that understand that, you know, and they ask you, like, let's go out. It's Friday night. And you're like, sorry, got a competition tomorrow. Or even, like, weekends, training on weekends, like Friday nights when everybody, you know, is like, happy hour, let's go to happy hour. And you're like, yeah gonna misfit train while you're all drinking and having a good time, you know, or, um, it's hard. It really is. And I'm just being honest. It's, it's hard. But yeah, I think I just needed to vent a little about it. Cause it's not, it's not easy and it's frustrating. Highs are high. Like I said, highs are high, but the lows are like soul crushing and Ugh, terrible. But um, luckily, I am a part of an excellent gym. People there are awesome. And, and you know, like, they have your back. You know what I mean? Like, ride or die to the death. So, um, that's all I'm going to say because this one, ready? Watch this. Cooper, you going to go in the car? <gasps> going to go for a walk? Look at the ears perk. Look at the ears perk. I love you so much. Look in here. Look. Look right there. Well, no, not having it. <laughs> that's a, that's a disgusting. But I love you. Okay, with that, four more weeks, three more weeks of the open. Um, uh, here's hoping it gets better. Okay. That's all I'm going to say because I'm rambling and I don't know what else to say. So, bye! Are you kidding me? I'm still recording. I thought I stopped.